G'day, it's Guru Tim here. I uh, just wanted to give you a quick video on how to set the Tab 5 when you're using the Arduino IDE 2.0. I had a bit of trouble finding it, so I just thought I'd share how I did it. So the default tab size is two, which I prefer to put a bigger indent of four for making it nice and clear when you're scrolling down to see where things are at. Now, the process of finding this, you used to be able to go into preferences and there was a list here of where you get the advanced, but that's gone. What you need to do instead is go control shift P, and this is in my recents because I've just used it, but if you search for preferences, open workspace settings, it will take you to this window here. And in here, it's in the commonly used, it's actually that one there is the one, but you can also just type in the top tab and it will give you everything that has that in there. But I'll just go back to where it was. So I'm going to change my tabs to four steps and I'm also going to increase my font for blind man settings to 16 and it auto saves so you don't need to do anything else. So if I go back to character now and I choose a new line and go tab, it's now four places. So now if I choose multiple, tab them in, it does the whole lot. So for me, that's a lot more readable just to skim your eye down and be able to follow the indents and things. So if I've got a, an if loop or something nestled like that, it will make it much easier for me to see what's going on. And just to highlight the font, we'll just make it really big. And I get much bigger fonts on the screen. All right, I appreciate your time. I'd love you to give me a thumbs up if you like this and to subscribe and maybe even a share if you're feeling really motivated. Catch you next time.